Hi there, this is Hello for Now about and in this video we are comparing the Lava Iris X8 with Samsung Galaxy Core Prime. Both of them have similar pricing and both of them are available offline. So let us now look at the beauty how they look like and we'll see this first. The beauty of Samsung Galaxy Core Prime is normal which means that it is just a typical Samsung smartphone where all Samsung smartphone looks same uh, either it is uh, Samsung Galaxy Y the old one or this one uh, they all look same uh, the, even the Samsung Galaxy S3 looks like this anyways uh, the look is not bad uh, although it has a plasticky feel so does the Lava Iris X8 but uh, uh, the Lava Iris X8 is a steal of the iPhone that's why I give a zero score to this smartphone that is Lava Iris X8. In terms of size, Samsung Galaxy Core Prime has 4.5 inch in size and the thickness is 8.1 mm which is not that much and also the weight of the Samsung Galaxy Core Prime is not much. It is just 130 grams and you also get a good display. Yeah, I mean it is not HD display but the display is much 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 better and you can uh, really feel the uh, display of the this device uh, even though not hd but it is just like hd now when you look at the lava iris x8 the thickness is uh, 8.6 mm which is just 0.5 mm uh, more than samsung galaxy core prime and also the size is uh, large uh, even though it is just five inches because of the bezels that they have given they have given huge bezels and that's why lava iris x8 looks large also the display is hd and ips while the display of samsung galaxy core prime is not hd but yet the display of the lava iris x8 is dull when you look at the performance of the Lava Iris X8, you can see that the Lava Iris X8 uh, has 1.4 GHz octa core processor, but it is still uh, the navigation is slow. I mean, uh, yeah, yeah, really. When I handle the smartphone and when I handle other smartphones, I feel uh, that there is something uh, missing in the Lava Iris X8, and I'm saying this one from my heart because I know there is something missing when using uh, the uh, Lava Iris X8. Uh, uh, while you look at the Samsung Galaxy Pro. Pro prime it runs all kinds of games the performance is fast the navigation is fast even though you know samsung comes with a bloatware and the touch with ui is really terrible but still the samsung galaxy core prime performs good in gaming now when you look at the camera of the samsung galaxy core prime this is what we are addressing next uh, the camera of the rear camera that is 5 megapixel is okay uh, you can handle it but when co it comes to front camera uh, the camera of samsung galaxy core prime is really weak uh, you should see my uh, front camera sample and you can see that the uh, light uh, the uh, the video it produces is uh, dark it does not respond very well uh, to the low light situations while the same camera from the micromax canvas uaq 5000 performed really well but since here we are talking about the lava iris x8 uh, the camera of lava iris x8 X8 is 8 megapixel in the rear and 2 megapixel on the, in the front and yes of course the quality of the Lava Iris X8 is better when it comes to the front camera not rear camera in rear camera uh, I think uh, there is a lot of detail in Lava Iris X8 but it is still uh, matched to the you know, Samsung Galaxy Core Prime the internal storage depends again you know uh, the Lava Iris comes in variants and Samsung Galaxy Core Prime comes with 8 GB of internal memory where you cannot move apps SD card. I'll address this issue in another video though uh, because uh, a lot of people are asking me about that. In the case of uh, audio, of course, the Samsung Galaxy Core Prime is a clear winner. The audio is so crisp and clear. It's loud. It's amazing. When it comes to uh, the Lava Iris X8, clearly speaking, it's not good, that, not that good at all. Like the, the Samsung with, with the Samsung Galaxy Core Prime, uh, they should have improved the audio because Samsung really gives good uh, audio when it comes to its smartphone. Now, in terms of battery, I think uh, uh, the battery on Samsung Galaxy Core, Galaxy Core Prime is low, and that's why uh, the of course the its durability uh, is duration of. Uh, its battery time is also low uh, but in case of lava iris x8 the battery time is more because of this 3000 mAh battery so this is it guys thanks for watching we will meet next time in another video i know this has been a long video because of a lot of murmuring i did but anyways thanks for watching we'll meet next time